Well, hello, y'all. How y'all are today? Today, my little buddy Seth from Memphis, uh, Memphis, Tennessee, wanted me to do this video before I left Colorado. So, uh, I'm going to strap my GoPro on and I'm going to go around town and show you just a little bit of, of uh, Trinidad, Colorado. And we might even take a ride out the lake. I don't know yet, but uh, I'm going to turn you off right now. And uh, I'll turn you back on once I get out to my, my truck and get my, my, my air back. Okay, we'll talk to you in a minute. Okay, this is, this here is a picture of my outside in the parking lot of my apartment complex. This is a picture of Fisher's Peak up there, that flat one. It used to be a, a volcano from what I understand. This is an old store that they made into an apartment complex. And an even closer view of the uh, Trinidad Hill. This is Kit Carson Park. I'll, uh, I'll drive around it slowly and kind of give you uh, a look of it. Let me wait till this car here comes, comes by me. This is an old house that they're remodeling. Uh, I don't know how, I don't know whether it's up for sale now or not. But, uh, I'm going to take you over to show you this church here down the street. This is a Presbyterian church. And right there, that is a big marijuana store there too. So it's Quality Inn. We got a Holiday Inn over there. And uh, so we're going to go to the lake here, but we're going to take this route going through this old town and. Uh, I'll just keep you on the whole whole times here, so. This is the backside of going to Trinidad Lake. 
you go down 12th Highway of Legends. Uh, but this is going through this other little small town. I can't remember the name of it, but uh, it's a pretty old town, and 95% of it's Hispanic or Mexican, whatever you want to call it. So, uh, I was talking to somebody the other day and they was they were saying that they didn't know there's that many Mexicans in, in Colorado. Here in Trinidad, uh, the biggest majority of people that live in Trinidad are, are Mexican. And uh, you know, I I haven't had any problems, you know, I get, get along with everybody I I know, so anyway we'll we'll be at the lake here in just just a short while. Uh, I like coming this way because for one thing it's more scenic and the other it's shorter to get to where I want to go. Uh, I, I fish on the south side of the lake and this takes directly to the south side. The other, the other way going down Highway 12 you got to uh, go down Highway 12 and then get off and, and come this way to Highway um, to the south side so this just makes it easier for me are still snow cap. We're supposed to be getting a little bit of snow here in the next day or two, but uh, I don't look for it to be a lot. So we're just about on up to the lake now. That used to be an old railroad. Uh, they took up all the tracks and stuff, so it's just a uh, kind of a gorge now. Trinidad Lake. This is South Shore, that's where we're going. hardly ever anybody here at this gate here. Right down in here uh, is where I seen that, that big herd of elk that day, that real early in the morning. I'll show you where they was here in a second. I was coming right in here and they come out right here on my left. Apparently, they was following this creek bottom and they come up, they crossed here and went over on this side and that big bull elk, he come out and he seen me and he come up and walked on this side and then he went back down in there, back, back down in the, the creek bottom there. So, uh, Every time I go fishing down here, I can see deer, deer tracks, and uh, uh, looks like coyote tracks or something like that where I fish. But down 
uh, it used to be way way up there and they have to release so much water for farmers and and uh, flood control and first one thing another so like I say the, uh, the lake is really down now uh, when I was out here the last time where them cars are parked right there it was all underwater and you can't tell it right now but that tower over there there's a white stain on the bottom of it the water was clear up to there so it's a pretty good sized lake uh, there's bass smallmouth bass crappie uh, walleye catfish uh, let me see uh, sawgeyes sawgeye trout and uh, several different species of fish uh, the water's pretty looks pretty choppy today I'm not going to go all the way down because you know it's, it just it is what it is so uh, I'm just going to turn around right here Well, I was hoping, yeah, there is. Yeah, a few people out here fishing. A little too windy for me.